Well, I won't back down. No, I won't back down. You can stand me up at the gates of hell, but I won't back down. Gonna stand my ground. Won't be turned. And what is wrong with our government? That is not the focus of my speech. My focus is what is wrong with us? We, the American people, what is wrong with us? I don't know what you guys, but I tire of cowardice. Woo! I tire of tough talking cowards on the left and the right. Woo! For the past 11 years, eight, eight years, we have had the most illegal, most corrupt administration in this nation's history, the Bush administration. Woo! And now we have the Obama administration continuing those self-same policies. And expanding. We as a nation have serious questions about what happened on September 11th. We suspect that our own government was involved in the attacks of September 11th. Where the hell is the outrage? Where is the outrage? Election fraud. An election observer in Ohio 2004. Our elect the electoral process itself has been hijacked electronically and otherwise. What is the response? Well, I'm going to vote really hard in the next election cycle. I've actually heard liberals say that. I have contempt for liberals, by the way. I am proud to be a fire breathing progressive. Yes! We talk about the need to impeach. I was involved with the Peach for Peace for the past six years. And now the Peach for Peace is fudging. I'm not impeaching President Barack Obama. Who is doing the same thing as what the Bush administration did. War crimes. Barack Obama is a war criminal. Just as much as George Bush is a war criminal. It's being ripped to shreds right in front of us. And what is people's response? Well, I'm going to write a strongly worded letter to the editor of the Star Trek here. That will show them. <laughs> Our Bill of Rights is being shredded. Oh, well. Economic collapse, the Pam talked about. Our economy is collapsing. And what is people's response to this? To vote in the very people to create the economic collapse in the first place. The very self-same people. Ron Paul and his campaign for liberty. His message. That's what I have great hope in. I tire of cowardice and of people on the so-called left and the so-called right making excuses. Yes. The Constitution of the United States is not a constitution for conservatives. The Bill of Rights is not a Bill of Rights for liberals. It is our Constitution, our Bill of Rights. Of we, the people, that they, they being Democrats and Republicans together, ripped to shreds. I say, let us all stand together on the principles of the campaign for liberty, standing up for all of us and all rights as Americans. Yes! 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 yes. 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 yes.
when we will need to fall to the tree of liberty with blood, be it theirs or be it ours. Seeing as how the Tea Party corporate corporate pro work system that we have in place is the problem that has gotten us here, I say the only way to move forward peaceably with a nonviolent revolution, let's be very clear, nonviolent revolution, yeah. is building alternatives, serious alternatives to the corporate corporate pro war Two party system. Yes. Are you with us? Yeah. Stand my ground yes. And I won't back down. No, I won't back down.